Hello and welcome, let me show you really quickly how to convert a blend file to FBX. Well, you need Blender for this. You don't have to install Blender, you don't have to have admin rights for that. You can of course download Blender from the website via the standard download, but let me just... No, no, I don't want that because this is an MSI file that requires administration rights. Let's just get a different version, Windows 64-bit in my case, zip. We're just gonna get this one. It's gonna download, it's gonna take a little bit. All right then, and I'm just gonna drag it over here, extract it. There we go. Now in here, let's find the blend.exe file, I mean blender.exe, and just double click it to start. And in here, let's just go to file, open, uh, discard changes in case there's something going on. And now we can just select the blend file. There it is. And first of all, if you have any textures in the file, just go to external data and select unpack all into files. In this case, no packed files to unpack. Now here we have a file that clearly has some textures uh, over here, for example, but there are no texture files next to it. There's only one blend file. So here it applies. We have to go to external data and unpack all into files. And I'm just gonna use use files in current directory, save packet file to so-and-so. Okay, and here we have it, textures. So these three files were created or rather extracted from this blend file. So make sure to do that. If you have any textures in the blend file, you will need them in the FBX. Because if we export this as an FBX like this, it is significantly smaller and obviously does not include these 860 kilobytes of textures. So you have to extract the texture separately. Uh, but to convert this to FBX, let's go to export FBX and it already gives it a name based on whatever it was before. If there's nothing here, you have to enter it here. And let's export FBX. And if you have specific needs, you can change them at the bottom left before hitting that button. All right, so that is done. Give this video a like, subscribe to this channel to support it. I hope this was useful. Let me know in the comments if you have any problems and I will see you in the next video. Until then, ciao.